My name's Corinna, and I suffer from something called topographic nausea, or developmental topographical disorientation, which essentially means that I get lost a lot, and I can't hold a map in my head. Um, I just wanted to explain a bit about how that works for me, and hopefully this will help you to understand other people who have this problem, and maybe be a little compassionate when we ask for directions an awful lot, because we do. Okay, so I've drawn a map of a strip mall here, as you can see. I've got a couple department stores, grocery store, bakery, and this parking lot here, which looks like a complete maze because that's what parking lots look like to me. Um, in my mind, when I go into a place like this, I remember each individual place, but I don't remember anything about where they're located relative to one another. So I'll remember that I saw a particular department store, and I'll remember that I saw a particular cafe, if it's unique, and remember that there was a parking lot that looked like a complete maze, and an art supply, and a bakery, maybe. But I won't remember that they all go together. Now. In this case, I've got a bunch of pieces that are all yellow, and they kind of look like a puzzle. But in my mind, each of these shapes um, can change. They are not the same size relative to one another. Um, I wouldn't be able to tell you, for example, that department store number two which I have over here, is bigger than department store number one, even though it clearly is, when you look at the, the pieces. I wouldn't be able to remember that at all. Um, instead, I'll just have a series of places in my mind with labels, and they may or may not get stored together in a little envelope in this crazy parking lot. They might get stored together in my head in a little file, and it might be labeled with an appropriate name, or it might not. Uh, it's very difficult with stores that occur frequently, like Starbucks or Target, um, because there are so many of them, and so many strip malls have all of the same stores in them, just maybe in a different order, or they have different names for the mall itself but I can't remember any of it. So that's how it works for me. Everything just gets cut up and split into pieces and they're individual places, but they don't relate to one another at all. I don't know what's next to anything else. And I'm really lucky if I can remember all of the particular stores in any per given mall. Um, I also have a really hard time navigating parking lots, getting into them, getting out of them. They're completely mysterious to me. They wiggle around, the lanes seem to shift, the places that you can park seem to shift. They don't make any sense to me. Um, I know that handicapped spaces are usually closer to stores, but I can't remember where things are. So I know that if I get close to the handicapped spaces, I'm usually closer to the store I'm looking for, but not always. Sometimes I get really lost, even just in the parking lot. I also get lost inside of stores all the time and inside of houses. <laughs> um, I've even been lost in a sukkah, if you know what that is. That's very funny. Um, yeah, that's how it works.